new at six, a major breakthrough in treating triple negative breast cancer, a more aggressive type of breast cancer. Amy Wattis has the story of a woman whose breast cancer battle is nothing short of inspirational and how this new treatment works. Hey, oh yeah, so <laughs> That laughter is one of the many things that keeps Siobhan Huck going. Truth is, she never thought she'd live to see her 40th birthday or meet her son. Siobhan was diagnosed with triple negative breast cancer when she was 32 and also while she was nine weeks pregnant. Being told you have cancer and 20 minutes later asking if you want to keep your baby is something no one ever expects to have to deal with. Siobhan continued with the pregnancy and began chemotherapy the first day of her second trimester. Months later and a few weeks early, little Crosby, yep, named after Pittsburgh Penguins captain Sidney Crosby, was born. He spent 19 days in the NICU at McGee. Today, he's a healthy seven-year-old, but Siobhan is still battling cancer, and Crosby and her husband, Jonathan, are what keep her fighting. I will do anything including multiple clinical trials, which she's done over the years, including one for a drug called Tridelvi. We took an antibody that binds to a very specific protein on triple negative breast cancer, and we attached a little bit of chemotherapy to it. It delivers like a magic bullet. It delivers the chemo directly to the cancer. Dr. Adam Brufsky calls this breakthrough incredible, since triple negative breast cancer can be very difficult to treat. The fact that we're actually able to take a drug and double the survival rate of triple negative breast cancer that's been through a lot of different chemotherapies already is a pretty big deal. The FDA approved Tridelvi in April following several clinical trials. Since then, Dr. Brofsky has used it to treat some of his patients. Siobhan will soon be one of them. I hear very good things about it. I've spoken with my nurse. She has seen patients do wonderfully on it. So that makes me feel a lot better. Dr. Brofsky is confident that this is the drug for me and this can really help. I have hope. I have hope. Hope that this new treatment will prevent her cancer from getting worse. I am very appreciative of the life I have. We have the best friends you could ever ask for. We're surrounded by good people. We have had so many adventures. Like so many other cancer patients, Siobhan is a warrior. She says she won't let cancer stop her from living each day to its fullest, and she hopes this new treatment gives her many more of those days with her family. Amy Wattis, KDKA News.